using tongs to pry the sauce out of the package after we thawed it for like two seconds. Hello, tiny reviewer friends. Today I'll be reviewing Trader Joe's Tteokbokki, Korean spicy stir fried rice cake. It's vegan, apparently. Keep frozen. Nutrition and ingredients. The it contains soy, sesame, and may contain wheat. Part of Republic of Korea because it just says Korean spicy stir fried something. The cooking instructions are the stove top, which is the traditional preparation for extra crispy rice cake. You can use the stove top for the sauce and the skillet for the rice cakes. We're just gonna do the stove top all together. I need to get this package open or to go in or do anything in the kitchen. I'm not baking this plastic wrapper. <clears throat> Easy fashion. It opened. It opened. It opened. It opened. It opened. <laughs> Okay, half frozen sauce that looks like paste and basically chalkboard chalk. Let's put this in the stove top and then we'll see what happens in two seconds. Okay, so here I am back in the kitchen. You're looking at some metal thing. It's a pot. We're gonna pour in a cup of water and then it's supposed to be in the saucepan, but then again, I'm not gonna go hunting around in my kitchen for a saucepan when I can use a pot. So there's water. I just poured it in. And Splashed half the water out of the pot, and then here comes, and then came the rice cakes, and then I'll put in the sauce after I get the package open. So we're pouring in the sauce. And, um, here I am. I'm, we changed positions. I'm now the camera woman. Before that, I did all the work. Lazy human. And then here comes my dad trying to pour in the sauce for in a very orderly fashion by using tongs to pry the sauce out of the package after we thawed it for like two seconds. So it looks like something like sesame in there. There's some like green pepper, I mean green peppers. Green onion, also known as scallions, if you want to be more fashion. Fancy, okay. Anyhow, it smells delicious. Let's heat it up and then we'll see if it smells so delicious. My dad was nonstop stirring for 10 minutes. I assumed he was like, his arm's gonna fall out. <laughs> probably it does, and probably it did, if possible. And so the, sauce, although it's liquid, I mean it was a paste, now it's um, more like a very thick sauce. We'll see it at the table after it's been transferred into a bowl and cool. I'm not eating that red hot thing. I'm back at the table with this. Um, I'm afraid it might be spicy, but you know me, I eat any sort of spicy things because I can. I'm just built that way. Anyhow, let's taste it. It could be hot. It is hot. I can see the steam. If it's steaming and it's not hot, then something's weird about it. Hot, hot, hot. My dad's rating is 4.2. My rating is 4 point something. You can choose that. I hope it's a bit more salty. The price is 3.79, by the way. My dad has it on his wrist because I forgot to say it while I was introducing it because I lost my head. This is really good. I love it. The spicy feeling is really strong, but you know me. It's kind of sweet as well. It's not like spicy and then it's gone. It's kind of sweet like a barbecue. Mm, I like it. Well, that's it for today. If you enjoyed this video, please subscribe and press the like button and meet me again in, on this brown slate compact table. And I'll see you guys again in my videos. Bye!